G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Joel Woodle, and welcome back to 7 Days, and welcome back to The Blizzard, which, as you can tell, is still cracking on very bloody nicely. I'm still alive, I've made myself a new base at the top of the 2-bit tower, never lived here before, in fact, I had some pretty bad memories for me once upon a time, but I'm trying to move past that, trying to grow up, which for me seems to be exceptionally hard. But regardless of that, it is about to be... Oh, <laughs> maybe don't get on the slippery slopes there, Josh. Not a great idea. Uh, regardless of all of that, today is a new day and I need to push on. I've got the money now to go and hire the baker that I found in the mountains. So that's what I'm going to head first of all. And then back to Jen's, try and get some better weapons, some better materials. All the gubbins that I might need to face down the next horde. It's only a couple of days away now. It's not far away at all. So I really need to start getting prepping. I do need to see while I'm out today. I need some more meat. I've got eggs. I don't have meat. I do have the ability to make bacon and eggs as well. I've got that unlocked now, but I mean, look, I can make so many bacon and eggs and they're so good for me, but every time I try and get out there and go hunting, the world says no. Apparently, just anything out there that's edible, it's bad karma to hunt even though I'm starving to death, so... I'm going to have to just kind of front up and deal with that as best I can. That's the wrong way to go. Oh, actually what I can do, what I do need to show you before I head out today, up to here, through to here. I've gotten rid of all the, like, the random little plants that were in the planters and I've started planting my own crops. Got blueberry, got aloe vera. On this side, I've got some coffees. I've got some potatoes. These are already part of the building and they're totally usable. That probably means they're going to get taken away from us before too long. But for now, they are mine. They are growing. It's great. It's a long way up to the baker, but I'm going to chuck a quick waypoint on you so I know which way to go. It's all the way back around me. Well, no time like the present. I'm not too far away from getting the mini bike, but I'm not going to wait for it. I'm just going to go now. Oh, get everyone. There's a whole little, a whole little crew out the front of my building waiting for me. How you doing? How you going? Do you like the size of my big... Flame in the sledge, hey mum. Is it? Oh, unlucky. Unlucky, Nancy. I fell down the big crevice. <laughs> Not even I'm going to save you now. So once again, I have been reading the comments that you guys have been leaving on these videos. But first of all, thank you for coming on the videos and well, watching and enjoying the videos. People seem to be enjoying this series. There's another jiggly snowman right there. I think I saw your arms waving again. I do not trust you at all. But yeah, for the most part, people seem to be enjoying this series as much as I am, which I am stoked about. It's very difficult, it's very hard, and I'm very nervous about what's waiting for me out in the snow drifts. But for the most part, it's actually really fun, and you guys are on board, which I'm very appreciative of. But one of the comments that kept coming up that I didn't really think about when I started this is... The mailboxes, such a critical component of early seven days, especially in Alpha 21 now with the crafting magazines. The mailboxes are basically non-existent for me now. I can't just cruise down the street and go like, pop, 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 and grab every mailbox I cruise by. I'd have to go digging to try and find each one, which I'm, I'm just not going to do, to be honest. So that's going to be a bit of a problem. And late game, it's going to be a bit interesting to see how far back on my progression I am because I don't have mailboxes. There's only one way to find out, I suppose, but definitely something you guys thought of that I did. It's a big old mountain up in front of me. It's a long way up. I'm going to quickly pop into Jolly Boys on the way through just to see what he's got. See if there's anything good in there or anything I can buy off him. I've got like $11,000 redo, so it's not too much of an issue. Oh, oh that's an issue. I forgot about that. He hasn't opened for another, <laughs> for another hour and a bit. All right, well, Jolly, never mind then. I'll come back to you later. Go to grab you, to grab that, grab some extra stones. I shouldn't have... Well, I've only got a little, a little bit left on my warm and fire. Uh, Joel, don't mind me. I'm just going to plonk down a campfire out here. You're all snuggling in bed. You won't even notice. I found a hooded sweatshirt. Oh, jeez, g'day, mate in old mate's pockets. He was just cruising around. I was bored waiting for Joel, so put a couple of rounds in him. Middle not great shooting, but I got it, uh, got it done. And you're better for cold resistance than my sweatshirt was. I thought the sweatshirt was the good one, but apparently not. The hoodie is the way to go. Gonna chew some holes for my thumbs in the sleeves and listen to music from 2005. Where is 
the vending machines. Gonna squeeze through. Um, oh, there should be actually, hang on, I'll be right there with you. Just let me go through this way, if I can. I'm pretty sure this is where the vending machines are. Yep, there's one right there. You've got sugar butts on you, thank you. Okay, yep, no, that works. That works, I'm gonna check the other one. It's just the snacks I was looking for. Yeah, need I do, I need so many things. I need so many things. You can just hold my hand and tell me it's gonna be okay. That would be enough. There's not heaps in here that I'm desperate for, but he does have, I'm thinking this one, mm, no. He does have back up in his book selection. He's got three get hammers, the sledgehammer crafting books, and he's got three tools digests, and he's got an armored up book. So what's that? That's that's six books. Six times three is eighteen. So not enough uh, spend it trying to warrant chucking in the sugar butts. Got to spend three thousand dollars to make that worthwhile. But I will definitely take. Ooh, hang on. Five more. Mm, no. Nah, 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 nah. We're all good. We're all right. We're all gravy. I'll take you. I'll take you. I'll take you. And I'll take you. A bit of cash gets spent, but it's progress is made. Place. Chuck all that in. You watch yourself. I'm like a quality five stone sledgy. So is that tier one iron sledgies? It is. Okay, so I'm about to get to the point where I can make my own better sledgehammer. Although I am curious. Now that I'm able to do it, can I make a tier five stone sledgy? And oh, I can make a. Oh no, no, that's fine. And will that be better? than the iron sledgy because if in the past that's always been the case but i'm curious if it still is now i've got my warm thrill good we're going to sold that to trade but too late now all right you ah why not why not i've got a fresh frothy in me pocket i may as well do something with it put it inside me see quadruple and start getting on the pedal there's a decent stamina region i can now just pin the bicycle throttle all the way up the mountain i have to worry about like rhythmically tapping the w key <laughs> <laughs> nope, nope, we're fine, we're fine, we're good. For once in my life, the rhythm is actually with me, but I'm putting it to terrible use. But straight up the mountain, back to the baker, give him a big fat chunk of change, we'll finally have a friend. Hopefully my drunkenness is worn out by then, though. Want to make a good first impression. I can't see anything through the mist, but I'm pretty sure I heard something. There he is. There he is, Baker boy. How are you? Please don't shoot with your super cool SMG. G'day, champion. Would you like a whole lot of money? I'm interested in hiring you. $3,300 renews. Accept. So are you just now like an NPC friend? Do you, do you follow me? I mean, more importantly, will you bake me delicious treats? Talk to Baker. Okay, command menu. Patrol around here, follow me, stay where I'm standing, guard and return to where I'm standing. He's shaking his head, he's like, nah, absolutely not there, mates. Patrol your coded route. Here is your... What? Here's your patrol. I... What? What? What is happening? And... Oh, he wants to pick me up, all right then. Do I need to, like, make sure... He's, he's holding an SMG, so that's pistols. Use SMG. Do I need to make sure that you have ammo or something? You've got nothing in ya. Or do you, do you get like infinite ammo? Can I just plonk you down at my horde base and you can help defend? <gasps> Wait, even worse. Do you count as another player in the game? Here you go, mate. There you go. Rinsed. Rinsed. The baker is cooking! This does make me nervous a bit. I'm not, so normal seven days will scale up horde nights when there's more players in the server. So having you, hey, can I, uh, can I pick you up? So, is there a way to see how many players are in the server? Okay, so it's just me at the moment. Cause yeah, if he's gonna make, oh, <laughs> I've turned him into a book. Chuck it back down. Does that show? No, doesn't show Ooh, one player kill. That was from Harley Quinn that time. Doesn't show you on the players list. So we might be okay on that one. But I'm not sure. This could be a real bad decision. There's a chicken over here. It's going to piss off the screamer gods, but I need some extra food. I've already killed a rabbit, and now I've killed a chook. Is it maybe like if you kill too many, you... Like, and maybe it's like Strayer. 
Remember, it's like that Australia game where killing too many innocents, I say innocents because apparently killing cassowaries in genuine self-defense, those things are absolute dinosaurs trying to stick bloody daggers into your chest. And apparently putting them down pisses off the gods of the land. If you do it too often, the gods come and attack you. So maybe this is the same kind of idea. I'm not going to push my luck. I'm already cursed. I've already got the shakes. And bad karma for 15 minutes. So you know what? I'll just... I'll hang up me slightly happy murder boots and I'll just wait till later. I've got 20 meats. That makes me five bacon and eggs. That'll be fine. That'll be fine for now. I'm heading straight back to Jen's. Now I've got someone else in my life. I feel like I at least need to introduce them. Let her know that not all of my cards are in her deck. You know, boy's got options. Oh, and he's talented too. He can make me delicious treats. Okay, listen. Listen, we're going to go inside and we're going to go see Trader Jen. I have to warn you, she's not very nice at the best of times. She might throw out some pretty scathing and cutting remarks, but it's all right. It's, it's literally the best we have. This desolate wasteland, not great for dates. So, burn your best behavior. Oh no, oh no. You know what I just realized though? The baker has a mustache. You know what, you know what? It's, it's just, I think it might be better if you just stay outside. Just stay here, stay here. I'll be right back. I can't risk showing Jen another another mustache. I don't think I can handle that kind of rejection. All right, she's getting the cold shoulder anyway. Cheers, Jen. Always love coming back to see you. She's not even really offering that much anyway. I don't understand the jobs menu. Like each day it resets back to like tier ones, but I can't go to the next tier. Like I, I was in the tier twos yesterday. I did a tier two. But now I'm just back to the tier ones. All right, well, I'll, actually, I've got the bacon now, so the uh, air supply is oh, going to be I nice and quick. Oh, um, oh, I heard kiss. Apocalypse hygiene and all. All right, I'll, I'll drink hand sanitizer if that's going to make you feel any better about it. I mean, it's made out of alcohol, so Australian's gone Australian. Oi, knackers, we've got a job to do. Uh, can you please follow me? All right, here we go. Jump on the back of my bike or... Just disappear either way, whatever suits you. Let's go find the plane. Oh God, I'm getting real cold though. Here's the marker for the plane. Stop over right here, lovely. Get a brand new campfire and whack her up. Whack her down. Sure, that'll do. Here you go, mate. Come over and roast some marshmallows with me. Please don't break out of your culinary prowess though. I'm already feeling a bit how you going today. Jen has not been nice to me. Here comes the tin pigeon. All right, listen, we have to protect the box. Don't let the zombies devour the box. No one wants that. I have on good authority. That's just a waste of everybody's time. So please don't let him do it. All right, mate. Here we go. Box is on the ground. He's already... Oh, he's already out and going. And it gives me XP. Oh, I got this one. I got this one. Don't you worry. You're not going about it. I'm all over it. Oh, they're champion. Maybe I'm not. Jeez, careful there. I hope you've got good aim because you're getting mighty close to putting a bunch of holes in me. Not enough substance in me to leak out anyway, so let's not put it to the test. Although, I was going to say, uh, does it only count if I actually... Shit, oh, I get the killing blow, not him. Yeah, because he just killed that one and he dropped a loot bag. But I still only got four out of seven. Okay, I need you to stop murdering everyone. I need to do a little bit of the heavy lifting. Dude, dude, stop, stop. Here, pick it up, put it in your pocket and... I'll get the last couple on. There's one more remaining somewhere. So, okay. I, th I was going to say, maybe the baker is too OP, but that makes sense. If you don't get credit for the kills, that's all right. This looks like the last one. You're going to go for me in the box? You got it for me? See you later, air supply. I mean, nothing much in here, but I was expecting that anyway. I'm going to put the baker boy back down. There you are. How are you, champion? Sorry about that. I had to pick you up like a Pokemon. Back into my pocket you go. Also need... Oh, actually, I can probably make it back. Yeah, I reckon I can. I can make it back to Jen's, grab the stones and get out of here. Come on, Barry. Barry the Baker. It's officially his name now. Let's get out of here. Job has been done, Jen. It was 100% me, so please give me... But you can call me Dr. Jen. 100% of the rewards. I thought for a second the Baker followed me in here. You're introducing yourself to Baz, but... Nah, that's right. Helmet light yeah. mod. Yes, please. Absolutely. It gets a little bit dim here and there. A tier two. You know what? 
I'm going to do the other air supply. I know it might seem silly because, I mean, you don't get much out of them. But if I can do that relatively quickly, I can have a couple of options for tier twos and not just, uh, like, the one fetch. I'm a little bit thirsty, so chuck it in quick. I've got not a lot to eat at the moment. My grill's still here. No, I need... No, Josh, you need the meat for bacon and eggs, you muppets. Just don't get tempted. Just don't do something dumb for like... For, for you not do something dumb for five minutes. This will be the next one right about here. Jump off. Campfire down. We're getting into a nice little routine. Where? I'm, but where? Where's Barry? Did he sneak off and go see Trainer Chen behind my back? I bet he did. I bet he did. So I'm out here. All on me lonesome and lonesome. That bloody traitorous little baker boy. You know what? I'm never going to have sympathy for you again. Every time you have to get up at four in the morning to bake freaking loaves of bread, I'm going to laugh at your silly weird hat wearing face. How dare you go and see Jen without me? I, I tried to keep him apart, but the power of the mustache was too strong. At least now I won't have to worry about old mate stealing my kills. <laughs> he's no longer stealing my kills. He's now stealing my girl. Yeah, g'day and g'day you two. They're not spawning underneath the snow anymore, it seems like. So, oh my god. That seems to not be quite as much of an issue. Wait for us time to come back again. You're going for me, not the box. Sat, you're going for me, not the box. Ah, as well. Who was oh my god. Oh shit. Okay, okay. That is a problem. I've gone with the, yes, with the pipe machine gun rather than the pistol, which was probably a choice. You need to numb. You're going for the box as well. Snuck up behind me. Snuck up behind me and almost rattled me bones. Gone. Okay. If only I had some sort of friend by my side to protect me from that. I need someone watching me back, not watching Jens. Look, there he is. There he is so fresh from leaving Jens church. Although, is this because I didn't tell you to follow me again? Is this, is it? I think it might've been. <laughs> I'm not going to take the blame for it, though. I refuse that responsibility for any of my actions. Oh, wait. And this is just one of... No, no, no. Stop. Stop. Man. Stay there. <laughs> Jen, you saw nothing. Don't ask. So, I won't tell. What are you buying today? I'm just returning from my brave quest. Before I do, I did actually spend a couple of my points to get up to Daring Adventurer level 2. So I get some better stuff, get some better rewards, wow, which is hopefully going to be... Good, Good job. 10 pipe bombs. Absolutely, I'll take that. Thank you very much. Ooh. 100 meters away for a clear zombies. Will it count if the baker kills the zombie? Like, a zombie dying is zombie dying, right? But it didn't count for the airdrop. You know what? For the science, we're going to oh, know. We're going to know for more the science. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon. We're going to the vets. Close that behind. Oh, oh, excuse me. Excuse me. No. Oh, for goodness sake. You, commands, follow me. Close Jen's jaw. Door even. We're gentlemen after all. Can't be letting in the draft. This is the place right here. Oh, is it? I was going to say, is it somewhere I've been? Oh, get out, mate. <laughs> it's not somewhere I've been before. We're fine. We're going to go in through the roof again. Tier 2 clear. Boop. Ah, uh, I do actually need my campfire. Always need to put the camp campfire down first. I just had a thought though. Hang on. You go there. And I'm going to chuck in that. Just keep ourselves warmer while we faff about. I've got a lot of gubbins on me. Do you, do, can you... I can do... I can just... I can do, oh, not the pipe bombs. Or you're accidentally using those. You can have some armor on you though. And a sweatshirt. Keep you warm. Hold on to all of that. You're like a mini bike, but better. You're a... I've, I've hired myself a Sherpa. You can carry all my burdens. I should rename you Lydia. I hope I'm not going into something too dire, but uh, this will work. Oh, right next to the entryway. Okay, nice. Oi, uh, Baz, you want to follow me down here whenever you're ready there, champion? I'll be ready and waiting for her. There's usually someone behind the counter. There you are. Off you get. And down you go. <laughs> floppy about like you're partially deflated but we're all good Baza, how you doing up there mate you're all good you want to you want to join me down here whenever you're ready come on mate come on mate get in the hole i do actually think he's stuck i, I actually think he's stuck up there i'm gonna have to go up there and like break out some more snow or something for him i can now make pumpkin bread and blueberry pie i mean that's actually not too bad pump wait pumpkin bread is not one like the really good 
food options. It's like cornbread, but better. Interesting. I'm really having to learn to, uh, like new items and what's good for what in this series. All of my old habits are definitely going by the wayside. Snake. Do you give me bad karma? You do not because you're a little danger noodle. I'm in the mood for ramen. Noodles for everyone. All right, mate. I gotcha. I gotcha. There you go. Look, it snows out of the way. What the? What? What were you just doing? Were you trying to swim? I'm not sure, but you should be fine to come through the gap now. Or do I need to like make it even more inviting to you? Like this? What if I do that? What if I do that? Do you like me now? Oi! In fact, you know what? You know what? Sod it. Sod it. Dickhead, come in. Talk to you. I can pick you up with all of the things still in your pockets. I've lost my warmth though. I've lost my warmth. We're getting cold. Oh, I've... Mm, hang on. You. That one. There you go. And on. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, we're all good. When I'm inside, though, I have the shelter, so it's not nearly as bad. I can take those ones back. Drop on down. And then lock you down with me. <laughs> if you want to go in the hole by choice, I'll force you. Get the green. There you are. Still got all the gummies in your inventory. All right, let's rock and roll. I've only got the two lockpicks on me that I found in some garbage. Uh, I'm going to scrap you for the... Oh, and read you, actually, for our inventory space. All right. One of the only times ever I've kind of wished that it had the normal countdown system that it had a chance to get in on the first crack, whereas this way... I'm absolutely going to snap this thing before I get anywhere close to getting into it. Ah, shit, there goes one. Try again. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're close. We're close. Oh, we're fucking... <laughs> Let me inside ya. Let me inside ya for five silver nuggies and a tier six bow. Oh, the clutch. I've got more clutches than a big fucking truck. Well, as good as that is... Well, it's, it's actually very good. I'm very, very happy with it. I need to get through the rest of the POI to find the rest of the zombies, but they're all... Like, out here somewhere. Out in the yard. Oh, outdoor POI suck in the snow. I thought this would be a nice, quick, and easy one. Turns out it's definitely not. There's one of them, though. Oh, I've got it, Knackers. Don't you worry, you little logging about it, you little baker face. You're down. You're gone. Was there anyone else? Any more lockpicks for me, actually? No, not quite. I will take that cement, because it's made out of stones. Thank you. I'm cucumbered. Nah, only for a moment, though. Hi, Baz. Oh, that's a zombie. That's fine. Bazza. Where? Where? Uh, Bazza, where have you gone? Well, my backup has left me, which is just great. I'm so stoked about that. You get out of the way, please. And you get out of the way, please. There are zombie dogs in here, which is why I kind of wanted to run with Bazza the backup. But he's um, probably on top of the snow, actually. Either way, not going to give me a whole lot of protection. And being like close quarters like this with a bunch of zombie dogs doesn't bode well for me. Stand up again, please. Uh, I'm not entirely sure where I am in the grand scheme of things. I'll get rid of both of you as well. I just, I just don't want to come face to face with something real bad when I can't get out of here. I think any moment now. Oh. I'm going to pop out the other side. That looks like a fence that might lead. I've got so many red dots on the compass as well. That might lead to where the dogs are hiding. I think he's just in there, isn't he? And I can't get a decent angle on him from here. Oh, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to do it the old-fashioned way. Get up close and personal. Probably lose a couple of tendons to him. In we go. I'm going to use the machine gun, actually, because that seems like a much better plan. Where's the dot? The dot's right behind the central pillar. One. Shit. Uh-oh. Okay. Reload quickly. There's also convenient dog-sized holes all through here, like they're freaking wombats in a burrow. You grab that one. Trade your air, because I would like the bones and the flesh. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, keep on going. Keep on going. Be brave. Through to here. Ooh, can I like, can I keep going with this? I don't want to fall through the ground again. I think I'm pretty close to him. I sound pretty close to him. Are they like just over here somewhere? Oh, they sound like they're right there. So, okay, hang on. Up and then over the little fancy. 
Machine gun. Oh, that's a that's a that's not a dog. Ow, that hurt a lot though. Oh, that's a dog. Okay, I'm trying to up. Oh, I'm trying to save as much of my ammo as I can for what I really need it, which is now. I think I got the dog on. Yeah, there we go. Dog down. Yeti down and you down. It's just a little clusterfuck of zombies I've been playing Twister in the Apocalypse. No more red dots on the compass, though. That's a marker. Nah, we're all fine. Okay. All right. Look, I'm going a little bit loud. There's zombies up the top. But hopefully the baker's taking care of the top side while I'm getting fucked on on the bottom side. I don't super remember where the house is. I think it's just... Oh, I think it's just down here somewhere. I'm getting... Oh, yeah, there we go. I'm getting... Oh! I'm getting sunk in the ground a little bit. Over you go. There's a couple of bits of wood over here that I'd like to take with me. Wood is always valuable. The crickets are starting to chirp. I'm going to have time to get back to Jens tonight after doing this. I thought it was going to be nice, quick, and clean and easy. Oh, I'm getting cold as well. I'm getting cold. Oh. G'day, Baker boy. How are you there, champion? I'm just going to continue on doing my own thing, though, because you've let me down one too many times. Quickly open that and then open you. Did it work? That did, though. You're nice and opened up like a good old breeze. No one else there. Just you. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. I need some sustenance. Oi, you're a baker. Go get me an eclair or something. I just got to rush. I just got to rush this and finish it off. There's also a bed there that should have something pretty good in it for me. Namely springs. Nets. Gone. One more coming. Gone. That's it for both of you. Oh, it's going to be so late by the time I'm getting home. Change. No, that's the wrong one. That's the one I need. Quick, grab you. I see those books as well. Vehicle book. Thank you. One more to go till I get my mini bike. Oh, I'm going to get stuck outside. I'm going to get stuck outside. I should be breaking this down later. But I'm committed. Just going to finish this off and get out of here. There's just no time left for anything else. I'm out the back where all the zombies are going to spawn. Oh, uh, okay. I gotta, I gotta like draw them out and let them start digging up towards me. They're all in that little building just then. Can I get? Oh shit! Can I get up and over this fence, please? Over to here. I need the baker to join me as well, which would just be absolutely wonderful. But I don't think I get that lucky. Okay, I'm here. I'm here. I'm good. Here's the door. Oi! Come out the front. Come out and fight me. I hope this works. I really hope this works. Pop open you. They haven't spawned yet. Yes, they have. That's a ScoMo. No one else I can see, though. Alright, ScoMo, you're just gonna have to cop this. Sorry about it, champion. That's one there. I can't see any of the others. Please just be you. If it's just you, I'm gonna be a happy bloody boy. Got a little bit close up. No one else has ever talked before to get ScoMo, but it's the first time for everything. Still not done. Still not done. Fuck. And now it's after 9 o'clock. Holy fuck. I'm gonna be outside at night time. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Oh, g'day, mates. Open you. That's bought, oh, that's bought a couple of zombies. Oh, he punched her on the back of the head. Job done. Job done. Can I get out? Um, I'm going to have to try. This is the way to the loot, and I've given old mate all of my gubbins. Half an hour. I'm so far from home, dude. So far from home. Up to you. Up to you. Come on. I could have just left the loot behind, but I can't. I can't resist. We're out. We're good. Okay, real quick. What have you got? Tier 3 rifle, full automatic, and five more brass and loot. I'm glad I didn't spend my money on the book before. Take you. Take all of that. Okay, get the stuff and get out of here. Oh, it's getting dicey. I've unlocked stone tools, quality five, and some spears. That's all good. Nothing else around. All right. Gotta go. Gotta go. It's gonna be cold out here. I know. My bike is so far away. Oh, boy. Where's my home? Where is my home? What What the dickens happened to you? All right. Oh, that's taken to the sky. He didn't want to be out here either. Quickly get some warmth. Jump. Oh, fuck. Jump onto you. There's my home. There's my home. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Pedal to the metal or pedal go around in circles. I don't really fucking care. Get me out of here. Oh, my God. I do not want to be here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Fuck. I was going to say, don't let the sun go down on me. That it absolutely did. Leave that there. Up. And then up. Come, no, up. There you go. The squelchy sound is Baker Baz. We're all right. <laughs> we did it. We fuck did it. Oi, Bazza boy, get up here. Going to introduce you to your new room. You've got free, how uh, free room and board. If you just want to follow me upstairs for a little bit, please. All my plants are out this way. My frame rate's gone to us. 
Are you guys growing? I have no idea if that means they're growing or not, but you're in the ground and hopefully doing stuff. Oh, I was real. I was puckered. I thought that was going to be it. All right, mate. Give me all your stuff, please. Show me your inventory. I'll take just all of that and put it all away. In fact, while you're cooking up, I've got one egg. Can you free, unfreeze the rest of my eggs for me? Here we go. 30 meats. And to make bacon and eggs is four, I think it was. So bacon and eggs. Uh, this could be 28. So that's... Uh, what, seven? I think it's seven. I think it's seven. I need two eggs, so I need 14 eggs. I've got one. And I'll unfreeze another 13, please. Chuck you on. Okay. So I'll get some actual food going. That would be wonderful. The rest of you guys can all go away. All right, mate, come with me. I'm going to show you to your room. Which, it, it, I, I, don't actually, I don't actually know what. You know what? For now, you can stand still so I don't get panicked when I hear footsteps. Gonna take some time for that food to get cooked up while I'm waiting for it. Do I have what I need to make my forge? And I can make the forge. I can then make my workbench again. I can't get the ones out of gens. They're protected. And that's just how it, how it goes sometimes. That's all right. Gonna have to just deal with it. Uh, need a log as well. Make you. And that should be... Almost everything I need except for cobblestone rocks. I need 44 of those cobblestone rocks. Like okay, 69. Nice, just 40. Nope. Don't track him, you muppet. Untrack you. Get you whipped up. And then to make the workbench. Got enough forged iron. Oh, I'll need the nails. Okay, so I do need the forge. That's fine. That's right. I need both of them anyway, but just to kind of get my life back in order. Forge is done. Grab you, change it over, and whack you. Oh, hang on. Not quite. Need to get rid of that one. Are you shitting me? <laughs> You're made of metal? <sighs> Son of a gun. Right. All right. I'm going to have to use the wrench to break you apart because the wrench does 50 damage to metal as opposed to like the 30 or something that the fire axe does. Hmm. I thought the ladders would just be nice, easy wood, but no, nah, I guess not. That's all right, though. Got a nice little spot for the forge here. Spot for the workbench there. It's all going to look spiffing. Ah, oh, shit. You know what I forgot back at Jen's, though? My bellows and my anvil. That is rather unfortunate. While I'm waiting for you to smelt the iron and the clay in to make the nails, to make the workbench, I can clear the other side for the workbench. Need two ducks, I think it was. Workbench. It was more than that. It was th another three out of you, please. Thank you. That's why I had to go buy the glue. Workbench. And yeah, I'm just missing like, what, 88 nails. All right, that's pretty much doable. In fact, that should be pretty doable by now. Nails, 25, get you going. We'll be rocking in no time. Put all the nails that I need. So I'll take you, thank you very much, and get my workbench on the go. Six and a half minutes to craft up you, but there's a spot right there. And I'm also grabbing a brand new torch to chuck in right there. Perfect. Oh, Baz. Well, you can't see it. When you come out around the corner tomorrow morning, let me know what you think of it. We finally have a house on the cards. But with that, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. A successful day, an almost disastrous day. I want to figure out what's going on with those quests and why it resets back to, like, T1 every time. That means, like, there's no chance I'll ever get to do, like, a T3 or a T4 because having to get through all the T1s and all the T2s up to the 3s and 4s, or just 3s to start with, it's going to be, I don't think that's possible in one day. But I've got my Bazza the Baker. I've got my house, got my forge, got my workbench. We're starting to really look a little bit better. But now it is day 13 and i got to start thinking about the horde. Do I go back and try and find them at the water tower again? Or do I try and find somewhere new? Although potentially having Bazza there with the limitless SMG, that might be the thing that really turns things in my favor. But I'll have to come back and see if I have any favor in the next episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you liked, make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.